Apple's entry into the ad chatbot field has been relatively discreet, especially compared to other tech giants like Microsoft, Meta, and Google. These competitors have been actively advancing in the AI space, leveraging the potential of large language models. However, recent indications from Apple's headquarters suggest that they are quietly developing their own AI chatbot named Apple GPT, hinting at a potential comeback for the company in this domain. So what makes Apple's AI chatbot intriguing? According to reports, it is built on a framework called Ajax. This framework is specifically designed to handle the creation of large language models, a significant aspect of modern AI. What's fascinating is that Ajax is rooted in Google's JAX framework, the versatile Python library that enables code to run on powerful hardware components like graphics processing units and tensor processing units. These components are essential for training the complex neural networks required by large language models, as they can handle massive amounts of data and perform intricate mathematical operations. The choice of Google's JAX framework by Apple raises questions about the strategic rationale behind this decision. JAX offers flexibility and power, allowing code to run seamlessly on different devices. Additionally, it's adept at calculating gradients, which is a critical capability for enhancing neural networks within large language models. Apple might also see value in benefiting from Google's extensive cloud tools and AI expertise, viewing Google as a potential ally in their AI endeavors. However, Apple's approach is not just about technology, it's rooted in their commitment to security and privacy. Apple is known for valuing user data protection, and this extends to their AI efforts. While developing their chatbot, they approached the task with caution, especially in light of the concerns surrounding generative AI. Generative AI has the potential to create fake content, such as fabricated news or manipulated videos, which could pose significant security challenges. To address this, Apple took measured steps, initially limiting access to the chatbot to a select group of Apple employees. These employees had to obtain higher-level approval to use the chatbot for specific tasks, such as creating mock-ups for new products or summarizing texts. The feedback from these internal testers was positive, with employees finding the chatbot to be both efficient and valuable in their tasks. Apple's meticulous testing and cautious approach align with their commitment to maintaining a high standard of security and user privacy. While it's true that Apple seems to be a bit behind its competitors in the public AI space, this can be attributed to their deliberate and measured approach. While other tech giants have been openly sharing their AI developments and integrating them into their products and services, Apple has chosen a different path. They've been relatively private about their generative AI project, sharing information only recently. Apple hasn't made prominent appearances at AI conferences or actively shared their research with the broader AI community. This approach, however, is in line with Apple's overall strategy. The company is known for its meticulous attention to detail, ensuring that new features or technologies fit seamlessly into their products and services. This cautious integration avoids overpromotion or rush deployment, aligning with Apple's reputation for delivering polished, user-friendly experiences. Apple GPT could serve a variety of purposes within their products. For instance, in Siri, it could create more human-like interactions and offer tailored responses. In iMessage, you might engage in conversations that feel like you're talking to a friend or mentor, seeking advice or humor. The Photos app could allow you to improve or generate images based on your instructions. The Music app might enable you to craft personalized songs, including melodies, beats, and lyrics. Additionally, in the Podcasts app, you could enjoy or create content on different subjects. These are just some exciting possibilities, and Apple likely has even more innovative ideas up their sleeve. So, what does all of this mean for Apple's future and its product lineup? To me, it holds immense significance. While Apple has always been a trailblazer in technology, lately it's faced criticism for potentially losing its innovative edge, particularly in the AI race. Some say it's no longer as competitive. However, I believe that assessment is off the mark. Apple remains a formidable player, diligently working to offer outstanding products and services. They're investing substantially in AI and exploring fresh opportunities. The introduction of their new AI chatbot is a clear testament to this commitment. But what's the game plan for this AI chatbot? As of now, Apple hasn't disclosed extensive details about its release features or compatible devices. Yet, there are some insights we do have. The leadership behind this project is stellar, featuring some of the industry's best. John Gianandria, Apple's Senior Vice President of Machine Learning and AI Strategy, is one of the driving forces. He joined Apple in 2018 after leading Google's search and AI teams for eight years. His responsibilities encompass key AI technologies at Apple, including Siri, Core ML, and more. Jen Andrea played a pivotal role in shaping Ajax, the framework powering Apple's AI chatbot. Another key figure is Craig Federighi, Apple's Senior Vice President of Software Engineering. He arrived at Apple in 2009, 
having previously worked at Nex and Ariba. Federi oversees major software products and played a significant role in integrating Ajax into Apple's offerings. These experts hold extensive AI and software development knowledge, and they're passionate about harnessing AI's potential for both Apple and its users. They are supported by numerous engineers, researchers, and other staff who contribute to Apple's AI endeavors. Tim Cook, Apple's CEO, provides guidance and direction. Cook is a strong advocate for AI, emphasizing its importance in today's world. He believes AI can enhance our lives and address significant societal challenges. He's even hinted that there's something remarkable in the AI pipeline for Apple next year, something that's poised to astonish us. Could it be a public AI chatbot, a novel AI product, or a groundbreaking partnership involving their AI chatbot? While the specifics are under wraps, it's likely to be an impressive development that will leave Apple enthusiasts eagerly anticipating it. Following a groundbreaking report by Bloomberg regarding Apple's upcoming AI chatbot, the effect was swift and impactful. Apple's stock price surged by an impressive $3.80 per share, reaching well beyond $197. This news unfolded shortly after both Microsoft and Meta announced the open-source release of Llama 2. According to Joseph Borey, the research director for Global Data, Microsoft's move to make Llama 2 open-source carries significant implications for the AI industry. Apple finds itself in a position of uncertainty about the best way to unveil its AI technology to the public. This uncertainty appears to be linked to Microsoft and Meta's strategic decision. While OpenAI graciously offered ChatGPT to the public at no cost, Bory notes that Meta and Microsoft have taken a novel approach. They shared the inner workings of their AI model, enabling other companies to implement Llama on their systems, utilizing the initial setup, and promptly having Llama operational. Bory raises a crucial question. In light of Meta's free offering of a model like Llama 2, which could potentially rival OpenAI's GPT, what does the future hold for the profitability of similar technologies? This situation presents a challenge for other companies seeking to monetize their AI endeavors. Apple might be feeling the weight of this, particularly as discussions have emerged about their perceived lag in AI advancements. Interestingly, Bloomberg's report led to a minor dip in Microsoft's stock value. It remains to be seen whether Apple's AI, the Apple GPT, can effectively compete with current advanced AI models, or if they are simply striving to keep pace in the dynamic AI landscape. Now, it's over to you. What's your perspective on Apple's AI chatbot? its anticipated features, potential obstacles, its competitors, and the innovative minds driving it. Please share your insights in the comments section below. Your thoughts and opinions on this intriguing topic are highly valued. If you found this video informative, please consider giving it a thumbs up. And if you're interested in more content like this, don't hesitate to subscribe to my channel and activate the notification bell. Thank you for investing your time in watching, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.